an integral calculus on logarithms. So we have here the integral of du over u that is equivalent to ln of u plus c. So we will have our first example. First example here, <clears throat> we have the integral of 2u, uh, 2 dy over 3y minus 4. So if we are going to examine... So where u is equal to 3y minus 4, and then our du, du is equal to 3dy. <clears throat> so if we are going to look at here, we have the integral of 3dy. Okay, that is our du. Then we will bring... 2 outside. <laughs> Since we have 3 here, so divide that by 1 third. So that's the reason we have 3y minus 4. So if we are going to examine this one, 3dy, that is our du. So this one is our du okay well this one this is our u so we have a form of the integral of du over u if we will have a form of du over u so we will proceed to the formula where in our formula that is equal to two thirds okay uh, so we have over u so Two thirds ln of okay ln of three y minus four plus c. So this is now our final answer. So and check if our answer is correct. So, so derivative, so we will have derivative of two-thirds ln, okay, you will have 3y minus 4, okay, plus c. So this, you will have two-thirds, okay, derivative of ln, that is 1 over, 3y minus 4, derivative of 3y minus 4, that is 3dy, okay? Okay, so you will have, so therefore, we can cancel 3 here. So, the fi final answer that is, that is, Two thirds, so we can cancel this one. Okay, so the answer is two dy, two dy, okay, two times dy over, okay, okay over three y minus four. So if we are going to look at our given, that is the integral of 2 dy over 3y minus 4. So this is now it's being checked that it is correct 2 dy over 3y minus 4. Okay, we will have our next example. The integral of 4 dt over 5d plus 2. So, where okay, our u here, that is equal to 5t plus 2. Our du, that is equal to 5dt. So, therefore, we will have the integral of 5 
du is equal to 5 dt. Okay. So, so we have 5 dt. Then our u, 5 dt over 5 t plus 2. We're in. We have 4, so bring that outside. Since we add, we multiply 5 dt here, so multiply 1 over 5. So if we are going to look at here, we have 5 dt. This is now our du. Okay. Then this one, 5t over 2, this is our u. So we have a form of du over u. So if integral of du over u, so you will have 4 over 5. So 4 over 5 ln of 5t plus 2 plus c. So that is our final answer. Okay, our next example, that is the integral of x squared dx over x cubed plus 4. So our u here, so where u is equal to x cubed plus 4. So du, that is equal to 3x squared dx. <clears throat> so therefore, we have the integral of 3x squared dx over x cubed plus 4. So what we have, we multiply 3. So therefore, we are going to divide by over 3. So therefore, we have now a complete form wherein this one is our du. And then this one is our u. We have now a form of du over u. For that case, proceed now to the formula. Wherein we will have one third ln of x cubed plus 4 plus c. So that is our final answer so we can check if our answer is correct check if our answer is correct so derivative of one third okay ln x cubed plus four plus c okay so therefore, derivative, so you will have one-third derivative of ln, that is 1 over x cubed plus 4. Derivative of x cubed, that is 3x squared. Derivative of constant, that is 0. So therefore, we will have cancel 3. So we have now our answer as x squared over x cubed plus 4. So, therefore, that is, we have here dx. So, you will have dx. So, that is now our, our given. So, therefore, our answer is correct. Next example, that is the integral of v dv over 6v squared minus 1. So, where u is equal to 6v squared minus 1. 
du is equal to 12 12v 12 dv so therefore we have the integral of 12v dv over 6v squared minus 1. Multiply 12, so multiply 1 over 12. So as you can see, our u here, this is our u. 6v squared minus 1, that is our u. And then our du, that is 12v dv. So we have now a form of du over u. So once you have a form of du over u, proceed now to the formula. So therefore you will have 1 over 12 ln 6v squared minus 1 plus c. So that is now our final answer. The next example that is number 5. That is the integral of 2x minus 5 dx over x squared minus 5x plus 3. So where u is equal to x squared minus 5x plus 3. du therefore that is 2x minus 5. That is dx. So therefore... The integral of 2x minus 5 dx over x squared minus 5x plus 3. So we have our 2x minus 5. This is our du. This one is our u. So, we have a form of du over u. So, therefore, our answer will be, proceed now to the formula. The integral of du over u, that is equal to ln of x squared minus 5x plus 3 plus c. So, this is now our final answer. Okay. The next example, that is the integral of y minus 3 dy over y squared minus 6y plus 1, where u is equal to y squared minus 6y plus 1, okay? And then du, that is equal to 2y minus 6 dy. So, du, therefore, is equal to 2y minus 3 dy. We factor out 2. So, therefore, we will have the integral of 2y minus 3 dy over y squared minus 6y plus 1. We multiply 2, so, therefore, multiply one half so if you are going to look at your equation so we have this one is our du this one is our u so if you are going to look at that one that is a form of du over u so your answer will be one half ln of y squared minus 6y plus 1 plus c. So that is now your final answer. Okay. We have example number 7. It's the integral of 1 minus 2x squared dx over x. So if you are going to expand that one, this would become the integral of okay, 1 minus 2x squared. So you will have 1 minus 4x. Okay. 
you will have 1 minus 4x plus 4x squared okay. dx over okay, x. So for that case, you are going to divide everything by x. So therefore, you will have the integral of 1 over x dx minus the integral of 4x over x dx plus the integral of 4x squared over x dx. You are going to look at this one, the integral of 1 over x, x. So you, that is equivalent to x, du is equal to dx. So therefore, you will have the integral of dx over x, okay? You will have the integral of 4 dx, the integral of 4x dx. So therefore, your answer, dx, this du over u. So your answer will be ln of x minus the integral of 4 dx, that is 4x. Plus the integral of 4x, that is 4x squared over 2. So that is equivalent to 2x squared plus c. Okay. So that's it.